Hard back, this, if you have the cross face and the head control from half guard, you know, we do this one a lot and you pass up to mount. When you're kind of flat in your back or you're still facing him a little bit, you have a much better chance than if he has my face turning all the way over here, it gets pretty hard to do much. So just try to act before he gets it that far. He's trying to get his body over this way, we're gonna bring him the other way. So just bicep in the side, head, foot on the ground, bridge him over a little bit. While he's there for a moment, hip out and get your knee in across the stomach. If you can't get your knee all the way across, at least get it halfway in and then get a little bit of space, get it deeper and deeper. This keeps us facing him and if you join your hands together, it just makes it hard for him to put the weight on us because we have something in between us and him. It's not gonna last forever. Keep your bottom foot engaged, hand in across the neck, other hand in, and don't try to just bench press him here with your back flat on the ground. Turn your back out and banana your body away from him. And then a stronger knee position is up under a shoulder. You can take a cross collar control or wherever you want to go from there, under hook, close guard, etc. But the steps again, big bridge, hip out, knee in. Frame, if you keep the, just keep the cross face there, or the grip. A lot of time he knows he's after fucking up one, one pass a different way. But a lot of people will keep holding on. So keep the neck, head away and him away. Knee up, control, and go wherever you want. All right, on two, guys, one, two.